So what's special about this? This is the Zemi Smart Smart Doorbell. Now it uses a door push that works on kinetic energy only, so no replacement batteries. That's a good thing. Um, the bell unit itself on the left has two buttons. One is to turn the volume up and down. The other one changes the tunes and there are a choice of up to 48 tunes. That section in the middle doesn't do anything except light up. So I'll actually I'll put this in place to demonstrate to you, but I'll first of all just give you an idea here of how that works there. There's no battery in there, that's just purely and simply the kinetic energy of me pressing it. And you get an adhesive pad with it, a good one, to hold it in place. I think that'll stay there permanently. I'm not sure what the point of this plastic is. However, there you go. The doorbell's very nice. There's nothing on the other side. This is the UK 240 volt version with a loudspeaker on the back there. Right, let's go and set it up and do a demonstration. In my office, finding somewhere to do demonstrations well. is always a challenge. It's a big office, but it's also full of stuff. So I will um, just mess around with the volume control here. So you can hear it running. Um, and down at the bottom there, that button changes tunes and there are lots of them. And just before I ruin the uh, back of the doorbell by putting adhesive on it, let's just show you 30 to 100 meters range, switch lifetime claimed to be greater than 200,000 times, and note again, battery free. Best laid schemes and all of that. I originally was going to demonstrate this outside. But as the wind in the northeast of England was unbelievably powerful, you wouldn't have heard my voice or the bell. So I put this unit on the door, and there you go. Works perfectly. I've used a temporary adhesive because the piece of adhesive that they give you will last forever. So just for the purpose of demonstration, that's mounted on my door in my office. And it's perfectly good. Works a treat.